I am Jade Thirlwall and you're watching Mariners TV. So were you frustrating mate? Yeah, really, really frustrating. Um, probably about as frustrated as we've, as I've felt all, all season, but you know, we've got to kind of shelve that now and, and move on. You know, we can't dwell on anything, particularly this time of the season. We've got a, a massive game just around the corner on Saturday and we've got to, we've now got to prepare and, and get ourselves well and truly ready for that one. Can you put your finger on what wasn't quite going right tonight? I think it was one of those games, you know, I think I think we'll we'll probably play worse than that this season and, and, and win. Um, I thought there was just a real mixed bag in performance levels tonight. I thought some players were some players' levels were were really strong and the, the difference between the, the performers tonight and I guess the non performers was 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 pretty big and um, we've got to make sure that that definitely doesn't happen on, on Saturday. We, you know, we need seven out of tens minimum out of everybody that wears those shirts on, on ahead of Saturday's game. I guess another disappointing thing tonight was Gun Cobbins' injury as well. It looked quite a bad one as well, didn't it? Yeah, obviously we're going to have to wait and see how it how it settles down next 24, 48 hours. Um, but obviously the initial signs are not great, and that's a bit of a blow to us. So me and Graham are going to have to get our our heads together and see. Um, you know, see what we do in, in response to that. Um, but again, you know, somebody else get an opportunity, and you'd like to think that, you know, everybody in the squad is chomping at the bit for an opportunity. Um, and, and you know, we, we need we need other players to to step up to the plate uh, because if we rely on on four or five players between now and the end of the season um, to essentially kind of come up with the goods, if you like. Then, then we're gonna, you know, we're gonna, we're, we're, we're gonna struggle. So we've, we, we just need everybody ready to, to, to play their part in, in what is going to be a, a pretty frantic, uh, fast-paced second half to the second half of the season. Things have really tightened up over the last few weeks in the league as well, and got higher on Saturday. It's yeah. really even more important now, isn't it? Yeah, we just said it in the dressing room that, you know, it was always going to be a big game, but I guess even more so after. You know the the points that we dropped over the Christmas period and um, the points that we dropped tonight. It's gonna we, we, again. We're gonna we're gonna rely. We're gonna have to rely on on, on people um, coming to the coming to the table and and and, and producing a, a you know a, a real a real top performance on on Saturday because anything other than a top performance on Saturday uh, will leave us falling short. How much do you know about Hyde? How much do you sort of expect them to, to Yeah, play? obviously, you know, they're one of the teams that we haven't faced so far this season. But, um, you know, I think they were they were here watching us tonight and, and we've uh, we've had them we've had them watch. So, you know, it's it's one of those, you know, we, we always we always do our homework. Um, we'll not necessarily look to make wholesale changes in the way that the way that we play. We've got to come out on the on the front foot. Um, on Saturday, and um, and you know, hopefully we're going to add a little bit of a little bit of quality in the final third. That just seems to be eluding us at the moment. Just finally, in terms of the injury situation, obviously Gavin will be a, a big doubt for Saturday, I guess. But yeah. beyond beyond that, who do you think will have a chance to come back for that one? Um, Barry Smith, who's obviously been suffering from illness, uh, Barry may have a chance of being available for selection on Saturday. Um, we'll see if he's available to train. Um, Anthony Callahan, I don't think is going to be ready for. For, for Saturday, he hasn't done any, any training yet with these kind of persistent back problem. Um, but apart from Gavin and, and Anthony, uh, we should have pretty much a full, a full squad to pick from.